Hello YouTube, today I'd like to do a quick review of the Oak Castle CD100 portable Bluetooth CD player, which is CD is in the name. Um, I did an unboxing video last week, uh, for some reason the audio didn't come up very well, it came out kind of wonky so I'm just going to skip the unboxing video, I'll just tell you what came in the box. In the box itself, other than the, uh, the CD player, it came with a pair of earbuds, which I threw away because they were low-end crappy earbuds and a micro USB charger for the device itself that's all it came with aside from the CD player so it wasn't too much in the unboxing um, one thing about the box which uh, is kind of strange to me is that it doesn't say anywhere on the box that this is rechargeable or that it has Bluetooth built in which is kind of strange to me uh, you think they would put that on a box for store shelves if they sell us in the store somewhere but um, I ordered this off Amazon and I will be putting this down link below if you are interested in this portable CD player. Um, so I'll put that down here. First thing I'd like to talk about is the design. Uh, it's a very basic round design. Uh, looks like your typical, I guess you would say, uh, early 2000s, uh, late 90s portable CD player like a Discman basically. Uh, you got your buttons on the front. I don't know how well you can see them. You have your play stop pause uh, your mode button which is uh, if you want to go into Bluetooth mode you hold it down for three seconds the Bluetooth icon appears then you put your headset into Bluetooth mode and it pairs up I don't have any trouble pairing it takes about three four seconds to pair um, and also your program mode let me see what else is here I forgot your program mode uh, you have the stop button the play button forward back and your EQ. Your EQ is for your basic rock, classical, uh, pop setting, stuff like that, um, which is pretty good. Uh, I actually like the uh, the EQ mode on this. Most of the time I don't, but this is actually pretty good for uh, the rock settings anyway, when I, when I listen to rock music. Um, one thing I really like about this device is it has a rechargeable battery built in. Now you can't get to it, so if the battery ever completely dies, you're going to be out of luck. But, uh, you know, if you can get five or six years out of this without if you use it regularly that's not too bad considering the one other thing i liked about this is it's only 39.99 um i went on amazon looking for a portable uh cd player i have a disc man uh, i've had it since 2003 and it's starting to go on me it's starting to turn itself on and off and um i decided why not look for a bluetooth one since i already have plenty of bluetooth headphones and um so i three or four of them came up uh one of them was like a hundred dollars which i didn't want to spend this one came up as a new item on amazon so i purchased it and as of this time these are sold out but i was able to get it uh as a new item when it came out but apparently in a week or so they'll be back in stock and as of recording this video so if you click on it uh you can add to your wish list and order it when it comes out um as far as sound quality goes considering it hooks up to your bluetooth test set i don't have any issues at all with the sound it sounds really good. I think it more or less depends on the headset you're, you're hooking to. If you're hooking to a cheap $20 pair of Bluetooth headphones or a more expensive pair, maybe $200 pair of headphones, that's going to make a huge difference in the quality. Like the earbuds that came with this were terrible. But uh, I, not many people are going to buy Bluetooth uh, enabled CD player, portable CD player. And listen to headphones anyway you have the option there's a port in here to plug your headphones in which is nice so you can listen with your headphones plugged in or you can listen with the bluetooth functionality but uh, i believe most people who buy this want bluetooth functionality uh you might even be asking yourself well if you have bluetooth headphones and everybody has a cell phone nowadays why would you want a cd player when you can just listen on your phone and while i can't answer for everybody for me it's the i like to disconnect from the internet sometimes uh put a cd in put my headphones on I don't have to the notifications on my cell phone coming up as a distraction I'm away from my computer there's no distractions sometimes I just want to listen to distraction and free music um, yeah 60 70 percent of the time I listen to music it's on my phone through either Spotify or Amazon Music HD because I like both of those services and it's convenient but every once in a while because I have a huge CD collection I'm 41 years old so I have a CD collection from back in the 90s you know up until now I still buy CDs every once in a while and um, sometimes I'll just throw in a CD and listen to a whole album and walk around the house, do chores or whatever, and I'm not connected to my phone. I'm not getting those uh, notifications and stuff like that. So that's one th reason why you might want to 
a portable CD player, either with or without Bluetooth. I just like to have Bluetooth because why not? Now I can put my CDs in and walk around my house, uh, do the laundry or whatever, and listen to a whole album, which uh, I think is becoming a lost art. I don't think people are listening to whole albums much anymore now that music's become. Pick a song, you know, Spotify, Amazon, whatever your choice is for online. So uh, anyway, this was $40. Uh, well worth $40 if you're someone who's never had a CD player and you want to get a, a little CD player, maybe start a collection. Or if you're just someone like me who likes to listen to a CD every once in a while. You've had CDs. Uh, you're, you're older. And uh, maybe you uh, you miss listening to your CDs. You don't always want to listen to it on your phone. Perfect for that. Um, I actually wouldn't spend any more than this. I, I, I don't know why you spend $100 on the other brands when this one does as far as I know, everything that does. Also, it has 40-second skip protection, so you can shake it around. If it gets bumped a little bit, it's not going to skip. It'll take a lot to make this a skip, and I've never had a skip yet. Uh, you're supposed to get 12 hours on a charge, according to the uh, Amazon site, because, again, there's nothing on the box that indicates this has uh, Bluetooth on it or a rechargeable battery, which is kind of weird. But um, anyway, this is the Oak Castle CD100. I've never heard of the company before. Apparently, they're an English company from a, what I've done my research on previous to this uh, recording and they've been around a while at least from what I've read if that's wrong I'm just telling you what I've read and um, $40 yes uh, if you're interested if you, if you have CDs or you want to start a CD collection this is definitely a good place to start